So what's going on guys, welcome back to another week in the life of myself and we are starting off this week with a very, very special day. Andrew Henderson, who's a world champion freestyler, is coming down, we are doing a video, I think we're doing a couple of videos, and I've just been planning the becoming a pro uh, drill we're going to be doing, okay? Does that make sense? I don't know, I'm not good at talking. But anyway, so let me show you the drill we're going to be doing, alright? It's going to be a quick glimpse. This is my plan. Look, this is going to be three drills. Three goes each. Oh, that's all you're going to see for now, but you're going to have to check the video out. I'm not sure when it's... I just accidentally stopped recording. Yeah, and as I was saying, I'm not sure when it's going to be out, but um, if it does come out any time this week, I'll put it in the link in the description below. But yeah, very exciting. And, oh, I forgot to show you. All right, look what has arrived. Where are they? <gasps> Wait, can I show you? Yeah, okay. No. No. Hang on a sec. Let me open them. Oh... My golly gosh, look at these guys, laceless Adidas 16s, X 16s, Ace, you know that you know what they're called. Oh my word, look at these. I've all tried them on, they're so bloody comfortable. And I think I'm already used to them. I haven't kicked a football with them yet, but they just seem like I'm oh, literally. Well, I cannot wait to use these later. I'm now at the Astro, it's just over there. I need to go pick up Andrew in about 20 minutes, but look who I'm with. Hi, Charlie Marley. We need to get on the pitch. We're going to set up because of Sunday trains. Andrew's a little bit late, so we're going to set up ready so he can crack on as soon as he gets here. You excited, Chaz? I'm excited. Excited to my new boots as well. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh. What if the wind is doing all right? So I'm actually filming the proper review for these tomorrow. But I thought I'd come out and have a little test run before we start today's video. All right, first touches with a football. Oh, they're so weird. They're like slippers. Ready? Here we go. Oh, these are tasty. Hi, Fio's vlog. Hi, Fio's vlog. What's going? How's it going? How are you doing, Andrew? I'm good. Happy to be here. Uh, in, uh, in Seaford. Beautiful weather, beautiful grey skies, my favourite colour, <laughs> like the hoodie. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, no, it's fun. Good to meet you, man. Yeah, you too. And uh, yeah, there he much, is. much love here. There he is, Theodore Baker. <laughs> nice. It's hard with the wind, though. Yeah. What? Cheeky. Cheeky? Oh, oh. Yes! Yes! <laughs> nice! She just finished up filming everything and look at the sunset. Look at that. Had I think it went really well, but alright, you ready to watch some magic? <laughs> okay, so that is the end of that. Everyone has gone. Andrew's got the train back home. Honestly, such a nice guy and unbelievably talented like insane like four world championships six uk championships if you haven't checked them out already go look in uh, the description because this link is right there unbelievable i'm, I'm really excited to uh, edit these videos as well the only annoying thing is that it was just so windy and obviously if you're doing freestyle and stuff like that like if you're balancing it on your head the wind is just going to blow it off you know what i mean so it's very very annoying that the wind was like that but apart from that Honestly, a very successful day, and I'm really looking forward to showing you guys the final outcome of the video. But now, where are we off to? We're off to Janine's house over in Eastbourne. So, let's drive. Janine, what are you doing? Janine, what are you doing? Janine, get out. Get out. No, no, you. I know you passed, but I'm you're not driving. allowed to. No, you can't get out. Come on. Come on, let's go to co-op. Janine, oh, what are you. What? Don't Do start pre to practice the gears because your gear stick's different. You're not actually driving. Right, we're going to swap around and go to co-op. <laughs> Hello everyone, it is now Monday morning and last night I left my camera in the car so I just completely forgot to vlog. I think I left it on, right, I'll go into Janine's, basically we just picked up some dinner, uh, watched Spectre and then went to bed because today, it currently 10 to 10 in the morning, we woke up at half 8 so early and I'm meant to be meeting Charlie at half 9 to film so I'm like 20 minutes late. Like a really bad this car, just exhausted this morning. But hopefully it'll be alright. I got his boots in. I got his boots in my uh, car, so he can't start without me. Eh? But yeah, we are filming this morning. We got uh, one, two, three videos to film this morning. So this is what I mean about 
action-packed weekend and yesterday we filmed with Andrew and the day before we filmed with Jamel so this weekend is major laser so hopefully we can get um, good filming on today but my, my ribs are just still hurting like they really are like every time I go to bed like lifting myself up just to like check my phone or whatever just hurts so much I like bruise I forgot I'm like, like bruise ribs actually hurt like they really really hurt and they just take ages to heal which is annoying but anyways yeah I'm gonna go to film with Charlie and I will see you at the extra. It's so warm in my car and it's so cold outside, I hate it. I ache so much. I didn't realise how bad my legs were, but oh, yesterday killed me. This is going to be so hard to film today. Oh, but the good thing is, look at the weather. It's not even that cold. Like, it, like the sun is really beaming down and it's really hot. Just hoping that my legs can survive today's filming because I'm absolutely shattered. Okay, so we've just finished up filming um, two of my videos. One was the boot review for these and one, the other one was a ultimate set piece challenge. We were going to film the ultimate striker challenge, but we've like both done our groins a little bit. So we had to do something a little bit um, less physically demanding, if that makes sense. So we filmed that one. So yeah, filmed two for me just now. And now we're filming Charlie's new forfeit football. And yeah, you'll have to find out what it is because you know, I don't I don't want to get the forfeit because I yeah, you'll find out what it is anyway. Um but yeah, I'm gonna go film Charlie's video and then hopefully we'll grab some lunch before because we've got to go to London. Well me and Ginny gotta to go to um outside of Lo outskirts of London to view a car for her. Very exciting. We just finished Charlie's video, just in the forfeit. How do you think it went, Chaz? It was a good video, but just look at my legs. <laughs> no, don't give it away. Oh, no, don't give it away. <laughs> what happened over there? It's like a bomb site. Uh, very fun video, very exciting, very coming out soon. Oh my god, look at all the footballs we got. Bloody hell, that was fun. But now it's time to pack up. I need to go back home, uh, pack my stuff because I'm going back to Bournemouth today. Obviously, as I said, with a pit stop uh, to the outskirts of London to have a look at this car. Charlie, Charlie, bye. Right, we are now on our way to pack my bag. I just keep doing that, I just keep cutting out bags. But yeah, as I was saying, we are on my way to pack my bag and oh, oh, hang on a sec. It's gonna be vlog central. I haven't even turned my car on. Look at this, it's like vlogging mania. You're so dark. Oh, okay. Can't see you. I look alright, but yeah. Uh, bye Chaz. We've got some bad news. We're just about to set off to go view the car. Janine rings them up. What happened? Got sold. Got sold. Today. Today. So what are we going to do instead? Go to McDonald's. Cry. Cry. Janine genuinely cried. She was like on the phone. She was like, they're like, it's sold. just like, oh. Guys, do you have enough chicken? Yeah. What are you making? Fetus. <laughs> For two people. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, you know, there's some left over we can have it later on. <laughs> right, so we are back in. Oh, I need my wing mirror quickly. We are back in Bournemouth. We've been back for a few hours now. Like, what is the time? It's 10 o'clock. Time to get a watch. And we got back. Hey, hey. Oh, the car coming. We, what time do we get back? Half six in the end because we went to Tesco's, didn't we? Yeah. And had some, uh, got some food. And then we came home, saw everyone. As you just saw, we saw Jazz and Dom cooking their fajita night. But now, 10 o'clock in the evening, where are we off to, Janine? The gym. The gym, even though, wait, wait why are we going? I'm literally exhausted. Yeah, I've got a headache. And you've got a headache. But nonetheless, we're going. We need to sign Janine up, don't we? I don't know how, though. Okay, so that wasn't a complete disaster. Basically, there was no one there, so we had to try and join up on the machines and it wouldn't let Janine because she had to transfer from Eastbourne to Bournemouth. Ah, oh, annoying, isn't it? But she did manage to send an email on the machine saying that she couldn't transfer, if that makes sense. I don't know why it wouldn't let you. It's really annoying. Yeah, but we're going to have to, if they don't reply tomorrow, we'll call up. And then hopefully we'll be able to get a membership sorted for tomorrow. If not, we'll do like a daily thing. But yeah. It's now going to be bedtime. Good morning again, guys. It is now Tuesday morning and it is raining outside. I haven't seen rain 
been actually quite a while, like a proper rain. Okay, so let me walk you through my breakfast today because we've got you and we've got a practical session and a bit. I've got to leave in about 10 minutes, but we have an Actimel. Look, haven't had that in a while. My classic Weetabix Go drink and my classic Ready Brick. Nothing changed here with breakfast. This is what I'm having pretty much every day if I wake up in time, which is really good actually. And what are we editing? You have to find out very, very soon. I've got five videos to edit as well. Okay, so it is, what day is it? It's Tuesday. Now I've just got back from uni and look what I've come home to. Look, this room is getting cleaned, like majorly cleaned by Janine. I came home and Janine was like, don't come in, I'm cleaning. And look, look, where's my shoe rack gone? I'll show you where my shoe rack is now. Look at it. There. Much better. So much more room for activities. This whole corridor is clean. And where do we find Janine? Cleaning again. You're mopping for... Oh, but do you know what the annoying thing is? Look how shiny and clean this is. I'm in socks. Janine, why are you wearing my sliders? Because I don't have any, so I... You need sliders. Why are you wearing my jumper? Why are you wearing my socks? <laughs> are you are you, are you for you or Janine? Right, let me go over here. Hang on. I need to show everyone my food of the week. Okay, food of the week. As you know, huh? Oh, Janine made me a lovely sandwich. I'm not gonna say anything else, but, okay. Food of the week. Every week I do a food review and I recommend something for you guys to eat. Okay, this time, it is, if you ever been to Tesco's, I think it's Tesco's, you get it from Asda as well. Chicken tikka spread. It comes in a little square box. I've just finished it, so it's in the bin. It comes in a little square box, and look at it. It doesn't look very appetizing, but unbelievable. If you like your chicken, you like your tikka, chicken tikka sandwiches with a bit of cheese, Incredible. So that is my food review re recommendation of the week. Chicken tikka spread from Tesco's. Um, and you can always add a little bit of grated cheese to do. You can really spice it up a bit. We are now in Tesco's waiting to pick up Jean's new gym shoes. Yeah, I got them from Tesco's because I get a little. Tuesday laundry day. And I haven't done a, a wash in like, what, two weeks? So we are lagging behind. But I got my card. And this is what you do, you pop it in there, you click the one you want, and then you click start. Oh, I'm so sorry, I might just hit you on the head. This is what looks inside a washing machine as well. Whoa. I bet you don't all have washing machines. <laughs> this is a good angle of you. Stop. <laughs> So I've just been editing the, um, the boot review I filmed at the weekend and I looked to my right and realised what the hell is Janine doing? Marbling. No, no Janine, no seriously. Seriously. Give me a hug! Give me a hug! Oh shit! <laughs> You're in a corner now, there's nowhere to go. No, no, don't, no, Janine, don't! Right, so it's now five to ten, we're on our way to the gym, and hopefully, all right, there's gonna be people there. We've got five minutes to get there. Hopefully they'll, like, you know, wait around for a little bit. I don't know why they would, but yeah, hopefully they can. And then, Janine should be able to join. If not, I don't know what we're gonna do. Maybe pay for a day, perhaps? Oh, oh my word! That was a close one, going around the steep, steep roundabout. But yeah, we're gonna go to the gym, and hopefully, um, yeah, work out and do some work stuff. Cause I, I've still got bruised ribs, so it really hurts. I can't do any sit-ups at the moment. And then tomorrow is game day, last game of the season. Now and a bit later, we're out of the gym. Went quite well, didn't it, really? But the thing is, with my ribs, like they're they honestly getting worse. It's so painful. The only thing I can really train is arms and like a tiny bit of chest. Like I can't do anything with my ribs. It's so frustrating. Oh, it hurts so much. But we did the run, the stair run. Janine side, Janine set off on the stair run before I set the timer. So I was like, Jane, wait, I haven't set the timer. She was like, it's too late, I'm doing it. <laughs> but um, I did my fir first time done was 9.3 seconds, just like the 100 meters, which is all right, wasn't it? And bearing in mind that is with my reels, which is so bloody painful. But yes, 9.3 is the time to beat now. Um, I don't know when we go, hopefully Thursday daytime maybe. I don't remember yet. Yeah, we had to do a, a one session thing for Jane, which is quite annoying. So we're quite hungry, yeah? And let me show you, you know the, um, oh, it's a bit blurry. You know the uh, chicken tikka thing from Tesco's I was talking about earlier? This is, oh, come on, focus. Focus, focus. Oh my God, here it is, look. Chicken tikka, if you want an insane sandwich, this plus a bit of grated cheese, unbelievable stuff. If you're interested in what's in my fridge as well, we've got Weetabix drink, Actimel, some flatbread garlic and tomato, a bit of petit filou, obviously. Greatest yogurts out there, some mild salsa dip if I have Doritos. Um, that Domino sauce is literally like since Christmas. 
I have woken up so ill. Why am I ill, Janine? Janine made me ill. She was ill for like the past two weeks and now I woke up, last night I went to bed with like a, a sore throat and I woke up like uh and my rib just absolutely kills. Every time I sneeze it's just so painful, every time I move it's horrible but oh I don't even have the energy to play football, I'm in so much pain. Look at the weather, it's sunny. This morning it was tipping it down in like thunder and rain and oh good weather but I am exhausted. We're now at the pitch, there's the squad and it's just started hailing so I don't know how much of the actual game again we have to record, but we have to wait and find out. Oh, it's game over! Yeah, Yay! Played, well played, well played everyone. Oh, we are home. I'm debating making this into a separate video, but if I don't, then it's, pro it's probably going to be in the vlog, isn't it? I'm so tired, literally I'm exhausted. My ribs are worse than they've ever been. I had to come off in the last 15 minutes. Oh my god, literally I'm shattered. I'm just going to, Janine's got uni in half an hour-ish. Is it? It's like quarter to five. Yeah, and then I'm just gonna lay down because I need lay down. I need a shower as well. I'm gonna have a shower. Oh, guys, I've just woken up from like a three hour nap. It's like, you know, when you wake up, like sweating because you've been wearing a t shirt and like it's just horrible. Oh, I'm so hot. My ribs hurt so much. I don't even want to go to the doctors. Is Janine home? Yeah. Oh, hello. Hey. I'm just saying, I've just made myself a lem sip, look. And I did the washing up. And I dried up and your food's in the microwave. But I'm going to end today's entry to the vlog here because I'm going to go to sleep in a bit. But yeah, Can I'll see you tomorrow. Film yeah, but... Okay, fine, we'll watch the film. But, um, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Right, we are back again. This morning was an absolute struggle. Like, I'm still... You know when, like, you're saying, oh, I literally, I just at uni, I was sweating so much. I even had a coffee. I bought a it, was, it wasn't a real coffee. It was a, it was a mocha, but a but when I drank it, it tasted like black coffee because I wasn't used to coffee. It no. was so grim, but I forced it down me, and I'm gonna try and force myself to like coffee because it really woke me up, even though I'm still in pain with the ribs and the illness. But yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to film top five skills of the week today. A because of driving, and B because I have zero energy. But I do you have the boo review coming out tonight? Ah, uh, now we've got to drive home. I'd like you to try an actual black coffee. I have. I have. I don't know if I may have told this story before, but when I used to work at McDonald's, the manager, like, I, she always used to get a cappuccino, and I made a white coffee to have some banter, and uh, she was like, what is this? And she, uh, like, in the middle of, like, a Saturday afternoon lunchtime, she made me try all the different types of coffee, like, latte, cappuccino, white coffee, black coffee, double yeah, espresso. You, I, like, you I almost finish. threw up at black coffee. It was literally the most vile thing in my life. Like on a Saturday You're lunchtime. You're never gonna like coffee if you can't even. What? Well, you expect me to start <laughs> start off with a black coffee? Yeah. No. Start off with a mocha and a latte. I did mochas are alright, you know. I can do mochas. It was just a bit dodgy at the beginning because I wasn't used to it. Used. Used to. It. I'm. You can. Hear, I'm so ill as well because I can't even hear up my ear. Did you know I'm ill? You just standing there in silence. Yeah. So I'm back from Bournemouth. <laughs> Been back about three hours. Very comfortable journey, and now I'm at Luke's. Well, not on mine. Roofs, technically. What are we doing, Luke? We're filming. <laughs> Why are they laughing? Hello. We're filming a karaoke video. But this is going to be the best karaoke video in the world. And it's going to be the best because I'm the one singing. Jean, how did I just do? Yeah, you did great. Right, let's ask everyone. <laughs> We're now in Tesco, grabbing some pudding because we've all finished filming. No, I won't. And look what I've got. Banana cake. <laughs> Back to the old banana cake, because I recommended <laughs> it. Oi. What's everyone else got for pudding? Oh, you got goo? Yeah, I've got Ooh. 50. Janine's got a mango. Who <laughs> likes the mango? Like the mango. Oh. Right, so it's now uh, Friday. I'm feeling a little bit better. And who are we with? Me. Joe. And basically, we're at the Brighton and Hove Albion Training Centre for another meeting. I just pulled in and cut up Andrew Crofts. Yeah. In his R8. There you go. Lovely jubbly. Anyways, hopefully we get the opportunity for a kick around. This place is unbelievable. Look at that. Bang, bang, bang. I've never been here before, have you? No, I'm gonna, I'm, I reckon we should ask for a, like a tour or something. Yeah. That would be incredible. Or at least like a kick around. I yeah. think if they don't let us play, then that's just that. Definitely. Order. Anyways, let's go have a look what's going on. All right. Accelerating. Oh yeah, when you put the burners on. Oh yeah. So we didn't get a tour in the end because we're saving it for the actual video, but exciting things happening. We're now in Marina. There you go. Going to, what are we getting? Lando's. Lando's, that's what we're getting. <laughs> I'm actually out of breath from that run. Yeah, right. But the thing is, Joe said, there's this, what's it called? Chocolocker. Chocolot cake is going to be the best thing Theo has ever tried in his life. Apparently. 
I'm gonna have to wait and find out. Cleo, this is it. Oh, I'm so excited for you. Oh wait, wait, it's actual legit. It's like yes. Yes. Go on. Oh, I really messed this one up. Right, come on. <laughs> what do you think, Theo? Is it dark chocolate? Oh no. It's so soft. No, it's I love it. It's amazing. Like, it's insane. It's just so soft, it like melts in your mouth. Yeah. I want to start mine. Oh no, this is really nice. It is. It's still recording. Oh, you get a bit of that. You get a bit of that. Oh, I thought I'm still off. Oh, shit. Day to day, I'm blind to see and find how far to go. Everybody got the reason. So I'm now uh, back at home. It's currently 20 to 9. I've just sat down um, on FaceTime with Luke and he was showing me all the footage from when we were just singing yesterday, which was there. If, if you haven't checked out the video, wait, I don't, it should be out Sunday, but if it's not out, I'll link his uh, channel in below. But if the video's out, I'll link the video because, oh my God, it's going to be so funny. Like, let's just say I can sing. Like, I know a lot of you think, Theo, you can't sing and it's probably auto-tuned. It's not. Right, I can sing. So that's that. And now I'm just editing the video of Jamel, which is also coming out this Sunday. Uh, it is a becoming a pro episode, and I don't know if you can hear, but I think I'm starting to get better. Like I'm not blowing my nose. I'm, I'm blowing my nose a lot, but it's not blocked. It's just weird, random snot, which is so annoying. Like I'm, I can still sound a bit ill, don't I? But I'm starting to feel a bit better, I think. And my ribs. I don't know if it's the painkillers. It probably is the painkillers, but they're starting to feel a little bit better as well. So hopefully I'm on the mend. Hopefully, I like, I'm touching wood. There you go, touching wood. Hopefully I'm on the mend, if not uh, saying that, I just felt something there. But yeah, I am going to go to the gym tonight and just do arms with Janine because she really wants to go, so I said I'll go with her. I'll probably take it easy, like I, I really need to take it easy for once. And then we're going to come back to mine and have an early night because I've got to get up early. Actually, I don't know, what am I doing tomorrow? I'm not sure what I'm doing tomorrow. But I feel like today I haven't really like, it's been really like uneven vlogs. Like I haven't really vlogged much today, which is... Yeah, it's a bit weird. It's just been sporadic because I've sort of been doing things there, there. So I think, oh god, this, I'm not going to tell you what happened because, like, I think legally I can't actually tell you what happened. But it involved a car and me being stationary. Yeah, you probably know what happened. But yeah, I'm not going to say what happened, but let's just say it was very, very annoying and it made us late for the meeting at Brighton. Speaking of Brighton, very exciting stuff coming up in the near, near future, honestly. Very exciting, and I know I said I couldn't show you the uh, training ground facilities, but they were incredible. And I will show you a tour soon of the facilities because I think we're going to do one um, within a couple of weeks, maybe. So hopefully you guys can look out for that. But yeah, I'm going to head to the gym now and pick up Janine. I also need to go grab some Mother's Day stuff because that's on Sunday. Okay, I'm going to go do that. Janine just got her, just picked up her new running, well, gym trainers. Where do you get them from, Janine? Tesco. Tesco. How much? Uh, I don't remember. 12 quid. That's no, how I much. Got, I got staff discount there. Oh, they're even cheaper. Look at those bad boys. Incredible stuff. And now, I am going to be Janine's personal trainer because I'm, I, I might do a bit of arms. That's all I can do because of my ribs and my illness. Are you ready to be personal trained? A moment. Your eyes are in it. Yeah. Boy. <laughs> Good morning again, guys. It's Saturday morning, the last day of this week's vlog. Where are we off to, Janine? Um, how about breath? Town, town. Town, we're gonna try on some helmets for skiing and oh, I'm getting a phone call. Right, let's go. We've just parked, oh, it just started to rain. Oh my God, well, we just had to go into the overflow car park basically because it is like a Saturday afternoon. Look at this it's traffic. It's so right busy, now. ready? Check out this traffic. It basically goes all the way around that way. Go on, Zine, explain how traffic works. <laughs> no, I'm just saying that like, like, this queue is probably like 50 cars long. Isn't it? And we are back at the car. I got a um, skiing bag, which is going to be a present for me for my birthday, but I had to buy it, yeah, if that makes sense, because like, it's just getting late. And we also got some ski socks, and Janine got a ski jacket, didn't you? Yeah. We are prepared for skiing. We're going in um, um, end of this month. Um, and actually, while I... At the end of this weekly vlog, hang on, let me get in the car without breaking it. <laughs> Actually, yeah, what I was going to say Why was... Did you try any helmets? Yeah. Didn't try... Oh, that's why we went to town as well. It was so annoying. 
Yeah, but I tried on your mom's. Yeah, yeah, I know. Alright, anyway, so yeah, as I was saying, alright, um, when we go skiing, we're also going to, we're after skiing, we're getting the train to Milan and then flying to Gran Canaria. So it's going to be like a repeat of last year's holiday, but different places. And guess what we're doing, Janine? What are we doing? I'm daily vlogging it. You're daily vlogging daily it. Daily vlogging it. So for two <laughs> weeks over Easter, that is the stuff we'll be getting. Hopefully you enjoy it. You seem to enjoy it last year. But yeah, I thought I'd let you know. This video is going to end very soon. So let's hippity hop over to do tire pressures. So I've just dropped um, Jean off at work now. now. I was on my way home and uh, Joe just texted me saying, are you, are you busy? And I was just like, no. And now we're just going around Joe's. I think, um, yeah, I, I don't know if I can tell you what we're doing. I'll find out later if I can tell you. But yeah, it's going to be fun. And that means I have a feeling that this vlog now may be... I was planning on putting it up at half five, which is in two hours, because it's 20 past three. Um, but yeah, I feel it's going to probably be up around seven now, because it's going to take around half an hour to uh, save and export. Upload will take like 10 minutes, nothing like that. But yeah, if the vlog is late, I'm very sorry, but I'm hanging out with a buddy. Um, and it'll make the vlog exciting, isn't it? Doing stuff. I, I always... I've started noticing, like, I think like other vloggers do it as well. They, like... They go out and do stuff so they make the vlog more exciting, inciting, exciting. And I hope it comes across that I am trying to do, uh, like, get out and do stuff to hopefully make the vlog a bit more exciting than normal. What are you feeling? So what you wanna do? Oi, Fia, you should have oh. filmed when we just did the test drive. <laughs> he looks alright. <sighs> I think he's... Happy with the space for activities. <laughs> right, so I've just got home later, much later than I planned. It's now 10 to 7, so I need to quickly end this video, save it, upload it. What are you doing right now at 10 to 7? Because right now, when this video got up, so probably about like an hour ago, I was sitting in my room. Let me know in the comments what are you doing right now, or an hour ago, if that makes sense. But anyways, guys, if you haven't enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below what was your favourite part of the video, and if you're looking forward to the match, the last game of the series, the last game of the season, which is coming out very soon. But anyways guys, I'll see you in the next video, so until then, I'll see you later.